That is one big gator right there, boys. Yeah. Boom. How's it going everybody? Welcome back to Jacked Up Fishing. Well, I got a good treat today. We put out at Hallover Canal. We got my boy Mark, neighbor, getting ready to go out here, get on some flats, bust up some trout. It's currently 8.15, getting a little late start. But uh, we'll see how fast it takes us if we get on the limit real quick. All right, stand by. seen his better days all right we're setting these anchor out we're gonna get set up hopefully we get on some of these trout so you guessed it we're using these croakers Atlantic croakers we're gonna put them on the hook right by the anal fin we're gonna hook them at the anal fin cast them out here we go So we're just getting started on talking, popping the croaker a couple times, and bam, I missed the first one. That's not a good start. Uh oh, there he is. There he is. Nice. Mark got his first one on. Oh. Over, over there he is. Oh, that's a nice one. Hell yeah, that's a good one there, buddy. Nice. Good trout there, buddy. Yeah, one for the cooler? Yeah, he's probably right there. Sweet. Oh, ah. I think I just got hit. Keep one over 19, so let's see what we got here. You got 15 and 19. What do you got there? Oh, he's perfect. 18 and a half. 18 and a half slot trout. Yeah. Nice. Sweet. What are we looking for? So these flats down the lagoon, they're just loaded full of trout. Loaded. They're not the biggest trout on these big flats, but they're they're numerous. Anymore, it's not fun to catch the bigger ones because you're just hurting them then. There he is. Oh, that's a good one there. That's a good one. Yes. Sick. That's a good one. There he is, boys. Nice trout. Boom. All right, let's measure him. 
Looks like we're eating trout tonight. Yeah. Oh snap, 16 and a half inches. 16 and a half inch trout. Boom! See that out there? Is that a freaking gator, bro? Oh crap. That is a gator. Give me my Dude, give me that camera, bro. That is a gator. Let's go check. Guys, I was just fishing. We're in the middle of salt water in the mosquito lagoon right now. I think I just seen an eight-foot gator. Easy eight-foot gator. If he comes back up, I'm gonna video him. He will come back up too. It's all sunny out here. So I got the camera down below my feet. I'm not even worried about fishing right now. I'm worried about getting this gator on camera. Next thing you know, I get a slam and hit. Of course, it's another little trout. And I'm while I'm pulling this trout and I look up and there's the gator again. So I had hurried up, got him off and uh, picked up the camera in hopes that I can get him on camera and get a good shot of him. Cause he keeps coming up and going back down, coming up and going back down. But when he's up, he's huge. We're just, we're just playing with this gator, checking him out. I just want to see what he looks like. Done it, done it. You want to fall in here, buddy. So the water depth is about two to two and a half feet. You can see the gator plain as day. He's right under the boat. So we're inching up to him to see how big he actually is. That is one big gator right there, boys. Yeah. Check him out. All right. That was an awesome gator. He was big boy. So, so far we got three trout, gator trout. We've seen a gator. And I'm gonna drink some Gatorade. So after messing with that gator for a little while, we picked up, moved to another spot, hopes of finding some more good sized trout. So we're down here by the Space Center. In one of my videos, I had a rocket launch that went up right over here. I'm zooming in for y'all. See if you guys can see it. Down that way is where the Space Center is. So we find this beautiful spot. Lots of seagrass little patches of sand in the middle of them so we uh just started drifting and pitching croakers at the same time and uh works out pretty good Ooh. there he was I got that one. That one's all good. Nice. Boom. Yeah. That's the one right over 20 there. Yeah. Right here. Look at the way. Yeah. Yeah, buddy. Nice. We slammed it. There's our limit. That's Sorry, a, Mark. That's a nice trout, man. <laughs> that's a nice trout. What's he got measure out at? Uh, he's uh 21. 21. Yeah, we'll take that's him. A big 21, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, there 
So we were getting ready to call it a day, and the sun was out up high, looking nice, and this one flat just looked real good. So we decided to give it a shot, throw a couple croakers at it. That's a fat one there. Oh. That's a gator there. Got them twin fangs. Beautiful fish. <laughs> that is an awesome fish. Love them fangs he's got. Quick measurement, about, about another 21 inches. Going back in. All right. Well, we're gonna call it a day on that. Got our limit pretty fast. Seen that gator, pretty epic. Good day on the water. So we're gonna go home, fillet these fish up, and we're gonna cook them tonight. So stick around, I'll see you at the fillet table. All right. These are the trout. I'm gonna do a little catch and clean for you. Show you how I clean these trout. So you're gonna pick it up right here, right behind the peck fin. Trout's one of the easiest fish to fillet. Right down the backbone. There. They have some super soft meat. Right down the backbone. It's easy to get on the wrong side of the backbone with these fish. So you gotta be careful, especially if you have a sharp knife. That's one side. The, bite, the meat's nice and nice and white. Supposed to have a trout dinner tonight. That you can see through it. So I got them all filleted up. Now I just skin them all. Just come back here, push against the bottom with the, and grab some of the skin and just roast. Now I try to have a really thin skin, so you gotta pull it down like that. You might have a little skin on there. No biggie. Let's get them pin bones out. Boom. Little rib cage. Oh, there she is. Looks good. All right. There's all the meat for it. We're going to go cook it up, have a little party, a little cookout, and uh, have some friends over. I appreciate everybody watching. I hit 2,000 subs this week. I appreciate everybody uh, who subscribed, who's liked the videos. Also, got uh, some work coming up on the GNU, so tune in for that. That's going to be a huge giveaway probably in about two, three months. And uh, that's pretty much it. Appreciate everybody watching. And uh, if you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button. All right, Jack, no out.